What's up guys, my name is Aryan with Ward Hardware and in today's video we're going to be talking about fittings and what are their general purposes. When it comes to water cooling, fittings is the number one important thing because a fitting can make things even easier for you or things can be a little bit harder if you don't know what you're doing. So always make sure when you're picking out fittings, know what type of build you're going to be doing as far as it's going to be soft tubing or hard tubing. But in general, once you find that out, everything should be easy and smooth sailing. For today's video, I got EK's Quantum Torque fittings, which are all lined up over here. Some are brand new, some just got released a month or two months ago. So I wanted to show you guys how these fittings look like and what are their basic operations. But just one more thing, one disclaimer, all these fittings from EK, they were not sent to me. I purchased these with my own hard earned money. So uh, I got a PC build coming up. Actually, it's an upgrade to my own personal rig. And I wanna go ahead and show you some of the fittings I'll be using in that PC upgrade. So make sure you guys just kick back and watch this video and just chill out, right? Chill out. Yeah, that's what we're going to be doing. These, these things will be chilling the PC. Uh, let's get to compression fittings. So compression fittings is the number one thing. This is going to be the most used fitting in your PC when you're doing water cooling. Uh, compression fitting consists of a collar, an O-ring, and a base. Some, some manufacturers use two O-rings. Uh, with EK, they use one O-ring, which is I think is plenty. And um, I've used this on bore silica glass. I use this on PTG um, and they are snug fit. I actually use these on brass tubing as well. And I've had no leak, no issue. Um, but these, these look pretty nice, to be honest. These are the satin color. Now they got these in various colors. You can get black nickel, nickel, satin. So I think depending on what you want and how you want your build to look like, um, you know, the color is really going to matter and it's going to really make it pop. So uh, I got satin right here and I also got nickel over here. Uh, same concept, just different color, but I really like the nickel. I think the nickel looks pretty nice, especially if you're doing a blinged out PC. You know, you want to throw in some nice um, G skills memory in there. Uh, and, you know, you want to have it just like a very shiny PC. I think nickel looks nice. But something about the sand I really like and I'm digging this a lot. Uh, let's move on to the 90 degree rotary. So 90 degree rotary is essential. I don't know about you guys, but for me, sometimes when I'm building a PC and it's a water cooling PC, I need to get a clearance over the fans that are on the radiator. And to do a 90 degree bend sometimes with that much of a tight radius, it's really difficult. So I've found these to be very, very helpful. Um, you can twist these around so whatever position you want it to face you can but pretty much you put a fitting right in here regular compression fitting and this pretty much hooks up to a tube and it goes right out in a 90 degree angle I think these are very essential when I buy these I buy a few of these and they come in handy also different colors you can get them in black black nickel I'm sorry black nickel nickel and uh, satin as well so really cool fitting right here and they pretty they look nice to be honest i like this whole like boxed out look it looks very futuristic i'm digging this next up we got the 45 degree rotary angle fitting now this one right here pretty much the same thing as a 90 degree instead of 90 it's 45. Um, so i think these are very essential as well when you're trying to get around the curve you want to hook these up and you'll be able to have a nice 45 degree tube coming out and it looks really sweet makes your life a lot easier uh, you can also hook up two of these 45 degree rotary fittings together and create a 90 degree fitting and i think that would pretty look that would look pretty sick especially with these like i said earlier these the way ek has done these torque fittings i really i'm digging these um and i'm and i'm liking them a lot uh next up we got micro plugs now these are a new fitting that ek released these are pretty much these are also they come in handy so in the past when i've done water cooling builds um, especially using a distro plate sometimes the ports are very close to each other so when you're using a regular plug to plug up a port um, they can grind against each other they can create friction and you're not able to fully rotate this uh, to ensure that you won't have any bad days, especially when it comes to a leak. So I think these are really nice. I haven't used these yet, but I'll definitely be using this on the next upgrade that I'll be doing because uh, I will be using a distro plate. And I know with those distro plates, they got very close parameters when it comes to the ports. So I think these will be very handy. And next up, we got these are extenders. Now, as you guys can see, I have three extenders here. It starts from small 
medium to large um, and these also are very 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 useful because there's times where you know you cut a tube too short or you need a tube to be much longer you know and these come in handy depending on how much size you need on your tube you can just go ahead and hook these bad boys up to a radiator a cpu block gpu block and you will get that clearance you need you'll get that extra inches to make your build complete you can also hook these up to each other so you can go ahead and create your own size extender however much you want but there's three different options you can get a small one you can get a medium one and you can get a large one like this one right here again in all different colors you can get black nickel nickel satin i think these look really nice and when i do water cooling i usually tend to buy a few of these just because in case anything happens i don't want to have to go either buy more tubes or start over i can just go ahead and hook these up and we're all set and done uh, another thing that just came out and these are the bomb skis right here these are the 90 degree angle fittings so in so if you guys remember i talked about the 90 degree rotary this hooks up straight to a radiator and a cpu block gpu block you can hook this up to a distro uh, pretty much anything that has a quarter inch um, threading to it but these these right here these are perfect because let's just say you're doing a build and you know you haven't done any bending yet and you need to create a 90 degree bend right well this is where this guy comes in handy because you pretty much hook up a fitting to this a tube to that end another fitting and another tube to the other end and voila you got yourself a 90 degree bend i think this is perfect and even me i use these and when i found out that ek came out with these for their torque lineup i had to get them just because of the next upgrade i'm trying to do all just angle fitting uh angle fitting cooling i'm sorry angle fitting bends so this is gonna come in handy again i got this in satin as well because i'm just i can't I, I don't know if i'm gonna do satin on the next build or if i'm gonna do nickel but it looks really nice it looks sweet and i'm excited that they came out with this we got regular plugs so as you guys remember i talked about the micro plugs these are their regular size plugs and what's cool about this is you can also hook up an ek badge right there they send it to you with the package so that way you can cover the hole up but primarily that hole is used to tighten it or to torque it down a little bit more um i think they're nice pretty much the same thing as the micro plugs just a little bit bigger so if you do have ports that are not so close to each other that might be an option for you to look at because i like the fact that they got an ek badge on it so it looks pretty nice um, and last but not least drain valves every water cooling pc should have a drain valve guys makes life a lot easier um, you don't need to do all these weird things just to get the liquid out trust me i've been there i had to learn it the hard way but these are actually a new lineup uh, new fitting from ek's torque lineup and how this works i guess you push and it releases the water it releases the liquid and then when you pull back it actually seals it so that way you know and then looks discreet too i like the way they did this this looks really nice you know if you guys remember ek and other brands as well other manufacturers they have like a knob and everything like that and it hooks up and i just think this is nice because this looks discreet it's not too big and um it's from their torque lineup so i think this looks pretty nice and I'm just going to have to figure out where am I going to put this on the next build because the distro plate's a front plate. And with these Lee and Lee cases, they got a front tempered glass panel. So it's pretty hard. I don't think the clearance is going to be enough to actually put this and then put a glass. So I'll have to figure that out. But pretty much these are going to be the fittings that I want to talk to you guys about. And I hope you guys like this video. I actually started revamping everything. So you guys will see a lot more videos coming very soon. Especially I got a few monitor review videos. And I got my upgrade that I'm going to be doing to my PC. So make sure you guys tune in and leave a comment down below. Tell me what you guys think about these fittings. If there's any one in particular you guys like. Uh, and also if you guys want to see some other videos that you guys have in mind let me know shoot me a message down below and until next time guys catch you on the next one